cannot get past the first level. Ugh. Welcome back, Dom. Yeah, I do that all the time. I get mixed reactions. There we go. There's the first level. I hope you like speedruns where you skip a lot of stuff, because I just. There's a lot of skipping in this speedrun. Sound cute. Once again, my wow. gang and I had given Inspector Carmelita Fox the slip. I All was I gotta glad say to see is, how well it. finally, the secret police file I've been searching for <laughs> all these years. With this, I could avenge my family and regain possession of our most valued treasure. It all began when I was just a kid, bouncing. Oh yeah, there's a lot of cutscenes as well. You see, I come from a long line of master thieves who kept all their secrets of sneaking and stealing in an ancient book. The Thievius Raccoonus. Anyone who read it learned to be especially sneaky, which is why we specialize in stealing from criminals. After I all, think... there's no honor, no challenge, no fun stealing yeah, from I ordinary can do people. Scene. You rip off I'm a master get some water criminal, after you know the next you're a master thief. Well, on the night I was supposed to inherit the book, five visitors came unannounced to our door. My <laughs> Mr. Rogers voice. My father fought <laughs> to protect us, but the gang of villains known as the Fiendish Five overpowered him and ran The surest the way to scare back. away anyone attracted the to me. The Raccoonus. Our family's manual of thieving wow. greatness fell into their filthy hands. They tore the book into five pieces and split it up, <laughs> each villain disappearing to the farthest corners of the world to commit dastardly crimes. Broken alone, I was dumped at the town orphanage. There I met two guys who became my, my lifelong buddies and trusted yes. crew. Yes, and I have a little train in my house that just goes around the whole thing. And Murray, part-time driver and full-time burden. Together we pledged to track down the fiendish five, avenge my father, and steal back the thievious raccoonus. I knew I was about to face the toughest test of my life. On this mission, I would either become a master thief like my ancestors before me, <laughs> or fail and allow my family name to bite the dust. He gets the satisfaction of being something well, other than a worthless turtle. Yeah, I don't really care for splits. Movie. This game is too inconsistent for splits. Use the left analog stick to move around the hideout and the X button to select things. I've already Alright, be right back. Gonna get some water. The road trip gave me the time I needed to study up on Sir Raleigh the Frog. As a young man, this hot-tempered frog grew bored of his life of luxury and privilege. On a whim, he tried his hand at a bit of piracy and found it to his liking. Raleigh, who quickly became addicted to crime, was brought into the Fiendish Five as chief machinist, where his evil tinkering genius rose to new heights. The last reported sighting of this mad machinist was off the soggy coast of the Isle of Wrath, a small island uncomfortably situated in the middle of a perilous Welsh Triangle. had or played is Rayman 2. No regrets. So Annie, the last run I did of this, besides it being just awful, I also had the game hard crash on me during the middle of the chicken mini game. That was after dying in it like freaking four times too. Pretty good. Welcome back, party. I'll decipher here in the van. In the meantime, see if you can find any more clues. The more I have, the easier it'll be to crack the code. Amphibio 
in your own TV. <laughs> Are you playing on a PAL TV? That blimp looks more like a machine than a hideout. You're right, Sly. That is a storm machine. It's the reason yeah, why it never stops raining around here. 60 FPS is so smooth. Around here. That explains all the wreck shots. Amorak is stupid. Well, why would Rotley want bad weather at his own hideout 24-7? Um, fast uh, disk speed only works for PS1 games. Steal my book back. For the reason that, um, PlayStation 1 games are all on CDs, while, um, not all, but a majority of the PS2 games are on DVD. So, uh, since DVD players require a faster spin speed to read off DVDs, uh, the PSP offers the option to read CDs at the speed that you do DVDs. Which is fast disk speed. But it's already going at that speed for PS2 games. By default. I'm not sure if it would work for PS2 games that are CD. It might. Hmm. I could test that, but I don't have any... CD PS2 games. Oh, that was close. By the way, the surest way to tell whether it's CD or DVD is by looking at the bottom of the disc. Like, on if it's a CD game that's PS2, then the bottom will be blue. Otherwise, it'll be like. Just Silver reflective. The only game I can think of is Gauntlet Dark Legacy. That's on CD. Also, yeah, they use PS1 games use CD. It's for Bill's Rage, my favorite favorite Spyro game. Or is it my favorite Spyro game? Uh, it used to be my favorite. I think one is my favorite now, though. And then I'm not sure which I like between two and three for second place. That large ball the clues have led me to believe that the code for this oh boy. I freaking hate the generator skip, by the way. It like is so inconsistent for me. Last run I did, I grabbed the ledge trying to walk off the roof like twice in a row, so he killed me. That was a weird camera angle. So far this run's got actually going pretty well. But yeah, I just skipped the whole first world. And I'm fighting Raleigh now. How delightful! We have a guest. The only thing <laughs> I hate the unexpected guest! Listen, Raleigh, wipe up my family and steal what Oh, I didn't even notice that before. Um, fast disk speed shouldn't even be working for PS2 games, so I don't know how it would work for FF12. Obviously, 
we should have snuffed you out as well. <laughs> so, without further ado... I mean, I guess you'd have to time it. We're like, I don't know, because I know like when Kara Karen was doing his segment attempts for FF10, he actually noticed that like, sometimes they would like, things would load faster, slower, just by themselves for some reason. And like, that wasn't even like a thing with fast disk speed, that was just randomness with the load times. Like, maybe his PS2 was getting too hot or something, but... Yeah. I guess I'll have to I test it later with this game or something. I can't imagine it being different, but hmm. it had been a while since I'd been back in the U.S. Next up, the notorious mugshot, ruthless muscle of a fiendish thigh. What he lacked in brains, he definitely made up for in brawn. Turns out he wasn't always that way. He grew up as the run of the litter. By the way, what I was doing there at the end of all, yeah. the neighborhood weekly. I said I wouldn't really explain tricks, but the only friends he could trust. Like using the diver attack to kill him, it makes me roll. It was there that he spotted his first gangster. Into the water when I normally lose that's control what there, kind of. And when I'm in the water, the even though I beat him, he can still die him. afterwards. On his and during that animation, when he's drowning in the water, I can actually like with enough pause the game or do the map. Like I can. Enter the menus pretty much, and I map warped you out of there because -boiled, street -boiled, and after I beat the boss, it auto saved. that he never be picked on. Because I did beat him, so like as soon as you deliver the final blow on bosses, it auto saves. So I just map warped to the hideout and went to the next world to skip watching his cutscene. So he's up because the game already considers me to have beaten I've him. I've always wanted to go to that thriving American boom town. Yeah, I use it for Spyro. <laughs> It's a little bit of drama now with like people using uh, FDS with games. Notably, Spyro 2 kind of got some issues with it because it makes a huge difference. And yeah. Oh, not what I wanted. Oh, what the heck? It. I wasn't even close to like. Whatever, we'll do the other way. It like killed me way before it should have. Like, I wasn't even falling yet. I was just over. Uh, it's like a second faster. Since instead of going back to that other, back to the left side after going around the fence and then going backwards again, like you only go across it horizontally once instead of twice. Actually, you do it two times more if you do it if you go around that fence thing on the right side. 
Because you gotta get those bottles on the left side anyways. So like you go to from left side to get the bottles, go on the right side, go around, go back to the left side to get the brick, the vase, or not the vase, the, the safe. And um, and you go back to the right side to get that bottle, that stray bottle. If you jump around from the left side, you go to the left side to get the bottles, go around the fence, up the ledge, break the safe, and then just go to the right side. So it's less foot That'd actually be more than a second, actually, because it also takes some time to climb that pipe. But yeah, it killed me early for some reason. So it doesn't even matter. What? Facial hair and muscles make your gun really shoot faster. If he uses the power of his double mustache. Uh, the coins are just... Every 100 coins you get gives you a charm. Which is like the horseshoe on my back. And that lets me take an extra hit, which is really good for this game. And I also need... I need to use the horseshoes for like certain tricks, like the super jump. Which is that thing that let me skip the first world by going into the cannon. Yeah, we got the 315. <laughs> Alright, time for one of the worst tricks ever. Oh boy. Complete praying and luck. Oh, nice, dude. Oh my goodness. That is really fast. Oh. This run is going too good so far. Like, even with that one death. That is pretty fast to get the catapult. Uh, I haven't really run Jack and Daxter in ages. I could hard reset here to save four seconds, but I've actually had it so like after I reset it didn't actually auto save, so like I just lost my run, so I'm like afraid to ever try it again. <laughs> I don't play just not any games. Spyro's Somniac. Maybe when my father knocked your block off with it. Your father? And this is wow. Insomniac as well, You're right? A I think it is. You know that Singus Rakamagookus had a lot of nice pictures, but way too many big boys. So you don't mind just handing it over? Why? <laughs> what are you kidding? You break into my place, steal my stuff, trash the joint, I feel transgress. Oh, slice up right. Never mind. Blast I don't know why I thought it was that. Ratchet and Clank is Insomniac. Alright. Just rolls to the place 
Eef. Not cool. That's a jerk move. I'll just do the load strat for skipping the cutscene. Just to get my horseshoe back. That was dumb. <laughs> I don't even, like, I'm not gonna go for double mirror because I haven't practiced it at all. And even that, it's really stupid to get. I would go for it if I had my horseshoe, but I lost it because of the dumb stuff. <sighs> frickin', this is part of the reason why. You won't frickin' hit the mirrors. He'll swing the cane, but it doesn't actually flip it, so like, I just lose my chance. Yeah, double mirror is just awful. Anyways, onto the third world. See you later, Abda. The third oh, world I'm not. Was the that was the last like priestess. full world skip. So you're not gonna see me like skipping like the entire world anymore. Born into a family of mystics. No, I don't have to do every single level, but there are skips scary. within the levels that save Teaching you time. herself to summon the undead provided what few This is the had. worst world, by the way. A career in crime allowed an adult Miss Ruby to punish the world for fearing her as a child. Chief mystic for the Fiendish Five, her powers allowed them to break both the laws of man and nature at the same time. Yet despite the whirlwind success of her youth, she managed to slip into obscurity. Like the top the last three. Last sightings claim she headed out of civilization Actually, and I don't deep know. into the Haitian jungle. Clockwork's world is pretty dumb too, but... I'd say the top five, three of those levels are in this world. Yeah, this run's actually going really well so far. So I expect it to get screwed over in this world to balance it out. Maybe a hard crash, maybe dying in the chicken minigame a lot. Would you roll? Something's gonna happen. Something always happens. Oh, camera change. That was close. Oh, get on rock. Sorry. Yeah, we got the slot. No orb? I don't think you can do no orb. Oh wait, maybe you could. I'm thinking of cells. Uh, I'm not sure if you could do... You get enough power cells that don't require orbs! Okay. <laughs> A lot of them are like trade 90 power... Or 90 orbs for a power cell. 120 for a power cell. You've done it. That was pretty good. Oh, <laughs> wow, Fina already left. Actually get a good run. Leaves. This is proof that he only likes seeing me in pain. Fino, the Mino. Is his name. Wait, 
this one. There is no such thing as faith in this game. Just blind hope. Oh, I did have it. Oh. Cool! Get on the post! Oh my goodness, what am I doing? What am I doing? Ugh. What is going on? Oh my goodness, get up there! Oh my! Why am I having so much trouble with this? Oh! Grab it! Was that so hard? Jeez Louise. That was silly. It's like not hard to get out of bounds there. Oh, it's just ground. I thought that was water this whole time. I can just like run down there and roll. What the heck, dude? It's time for Piranha Lake. Piranha Lake. Oh, that's a Binocchi Com interruption. Fish back. Not working. Oh my. Ugh. There we go. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There it is. 40... That was like 46 or 45. That was actually pretty good. Nice. Swamp key skip. We'd get too broken if that happened though. <laughs> as much as I hate this world, it would make the run a lot less entertaining. Whatever. I guess we're not gonna map or load warp. if it's really fast or not. But yeah, this world is just awful. We need to race it consistently. Yes. Played safe here because F those golden things. I need to relearn how to walk around that fence. I really don't like this jump. Cool. I just need to not get stuck in the log. And then this will actually have been a pretty good level. Hey! 
cool. This run is going really well so far. I'm... Something's gonna happen. I just know it. Like, something's got to happen. Uh, it's a variation of a time attack route that I found. It's not as fast as doing that crazy hook jump thing, but I cannot do that trick for the life of me. Like, I've not gotten it a single time. Okay, good light pad. Ugh, go. Ugh. Yeah, it's a little bit faster than doing the normal way. Well, hi, Fino. Welcome back. horrible at this jump now. Unless I practice it, I'm not gonna get this. I got it! What the heck, dude? This run is going way too well. I don't know if this is fast or not, but... Maybe. Because he runs over here, but then he has to, like, sit here for a little bit. I'll time that as well sometimes. Before this is in a really great run, and then I'm gonna be sad because I wasn't recording. What? Ah, uh, there's the one mistake. Didn't want to land on the spire. Alright. Oh, I hit this. It's okay, I'll get my machine back with the load save. times. Sorry. Oh, you just left for a minute. I, like, chastised you for leaving. <laughs> I was like, I'm finally getting a good run, and then Fino leaves. This proves that he only likes me when I'm okay. <laughs> also, yeah, the music's nice. Well, it's, good mood. it's okay, I'm probably gonna get a game crash on the I'm gonna get destroyed by the chicken mini game. Something's gonna happen. Remember, you can always shoot in one direction while yeah, if I record, I get no good runs. That's another thing. This level sucks, too. Yeah, this is. Uh, a grave undertaking. This level and the chicken mini game are just awful. chicken minigame just because of how bad that minigame is. I get enough coins. Oh, cool, dude. I fucking hate the ghosts. 
I hate the ghosts, dude. That is BS. I knew something was gonna happen to scroll over this road. Freaking. It's the worst enemies ever. with the ghosts is like, one, they're random where, when they want to show up, and like where they kind of spawn in their little area, but like freaking, they're really hard to hit, like the game is really picky with like actually hitting them, and they can hit you when they're like inside a wall, so like they can hit you but they're in a spot where you cannot hit them, so it's just like freaking hard to not get hit by them when you're trying to do stuff. Like, you're trying to hit them, but you can't. Because stuff either goes right through it, or... Just whatever. These chickens are good at making your, like, being good at being ghosts as well. Because the cane will just go right through these guys. Like that. That was actually really good. Oh, not a view map. Blah. Wow, 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 wow. Ugh, besides that stupid death, this is a pretty good one. I'm not sure how... Oh, I'm actually ahead of my PB. I think. I think my PB enters are like 40 something. Oh! Oh! Uh, okay. I can't load game because that would send me way back there. Yeah. That was dumb. Whatever, it's fine. As long as I just don't get that bug where like you just can't dodge a thing for some reason, then I'll be okay. I'm still ahead of my record. Yeah, well you give me the creeps too, lady. Cooking up an army of ghosts is in a very neighborly pastime. Like I don't know what kind of standards to have for this game if I want to submit one. Like I want to have high standards like every other game I'm running, but like, it's really not that easy with this game. I could feed that Koopa vibe come. Uh, I'm just gonna wait. I forgot how to do the... Just try where you just like, don't wait at all! Cool spire jump, bro. Thanks for listening to the circle button. I love wasting time. F it. You're doing fast rat? Yes. Let's go. Freaking BS, dude. <laughs> I 
I press circle and it's like, here. nope. That's what happened in frickin'... What is it called? Something Descent. I'd say this game is worse than Crash 2. Like, besides like the weird couple glitches in Crash 2, like falling through the floor and like having Komodo Bros be unbeatable. Stuff in that game is most... Well, I guess not mostly. There are some dumb hits that make no sense, but like... This game is just... If you repeat what I just do, awful. You'll dodge it just fine. It's bad as yours. If not, you'll get snapped. <laughs> a little voodoo Simon says, huh? Sounds easy enough. <sighs> I messed up a lot in the last world too, so that's where I'm gonna gain most of my time. <laughs> if I do get a VB. I died like five times trying. New strats that Annie showed me in that one level. The lava escape. Also, didn't get the cutscene skip, which is like a minute and a half. Not a minute and a half, but a minute. I need to get a non greatest hits version of this too, to maybe figure if I can... Cause, uh, I'm not sure if the Miss Ruby thing could be on that version only. for those X parts because he can actually jump sooner than he's you would expect because of the music. Starts the next attack sooner. Oh, barely. Okay. It'll never happen again. Travel plans to I don't know. Part of me doesn't want to find it just because. Um, the road trip gave me the time I needed to study up on. You know, it'd just be one more dumb trick to add to the pile. Born penniless, he was fascinated by the fireworks rich noblemen set off every New Year's. He spent a decade learning the art. But getting it would feel pretty But when awesome. he tried to offer his fireworks to the noblemen... So it saved like so much time. They couldn't see past his shabby clothes and chased him away. Humiliated, the Panda King took revenge on those who it's shunned pretty. him by using the... It's not a, oh, I guess it's kind of a dozen pile. The freakish five recruited him as their demolition. This is my favorite world, even though it's not the on, easiest to do. Explosive touch became the world it feels box. like this is He's rumored to be perfect. Besides like the dragon firework technique high in the unstable cutscene skip of Western China. The rest of this world is like it feels really fair. I guess the catapult's random too, but 
I can never get mad at the catapult in this level. It's too silly. I think I got it pretty fast on my PV, actually. Like, ten, within 10 seconds. The last run I got, like, I did in like three spins. <laughs> It's really easy to get that the first time you try it. I'm not, I think it might just be the angle that you approach it from that makes it easier, but... Oh, I'm stuck. Thanks, Shadow. Or... Okay. Helping me out. Can't see. Okay. It worked out. That's all that matters. Oh, that didn't work. Cool. I was like holding against the wall too. Thank you, checkpoint, for being right there. Oh my goodness. Cool. Trick I have here, but I'm not gonna go for it. You can like slide, you can roll down this hill and like with the momentum do like a further jump so you can reach that guy. Like jump over his light and kill him without waiting. But it's kind of tricky. Dude, this is the vault, but you need more clues. Music in the HD collection, the music is not in time with her attacks. Oh, tree. Oh no! Okay. Let's go around. I love that card. It's like oogity boogity boogity, and then like you unlock the door and he's like, oh, okay, whatever. I don't know. Yeah, it's harder because like you can't use the music to dodge the attacks like you're supposed to. Kind of big mess up on their part. Suddenly. I can't remember how this world went overall though. I think it went pretty well. On my PV. I'm kind of weird for like this minigame, I use square to shoot, but I'm, when I'm doing the one with Carmelita, I use X. What the frick? Weird. I don't know why, it's like pretty much the same thing. Was it the first button you messed it up on? <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. That little, this little area always scares me because like the rocket goes flying right past Bentley's ear, or Murray's ear, not Bentley. And then like the frickin' enemy goes through him. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, I'm like afraid of like doing Sly Cooper at any of the marathons. So I'm afraid I'm gonna get like just as bad. <laughs> it's gonna be like that all over again. Oh no. I don't get why it just like lags your shooting speed. Way to okay. go! Got a lot of guards on that right rooftop. Ah. Oh. Horrible trick. Well, lately I've been getting it pretty well. Knock on wood. Oh, what am I doing? I think I usually get him without waiting. Poop Cooper. I really wish I had a horseshoe. This looks like a good place to try out your new invisibility move. Pull down the circle button to drop out of sight. While invisible, nothing can see you. Oh, no, I jinxed it. Smooth moves me. I knew it. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. Hate this trick. Especially since you have to do it, like, we have to rush it. <sighs> I got it, but the light's right there. Oh nice, gave my lives back too. Finally know where to do it. Do which thing. <laughs> you missed one. I'm sorry. I got a 201 something or other. I lost like a minute on Lofty Castle because I died a bunch really dumb, like in really dumb ways and I got the game over. I can go all the way back. But I gained a lot of time in the last world. I hate the hooks. The hook trick is like just awful. I got it pretty fast there though. sometimes. Like, I wish I didn't freaking kill all your mo like, your movement. Which part? I 
so yeah, this game is pretty dumb to run. Oh, gosh dang it, I had it, and he just like slipped for some reason. The Unseen Foe, part two. Okay. I'll take it. Roll. Oh, nice. Didn't even grab the thing. Bring out your spinning. <laughs> That was the best trick in the game. For sure. I love you for finding it, by the way, Annie. Alright, let's see how the jello is formed today. Trigger for that cutscene is like a lot of triggers in this game. They're just like. They're like Jello, dude. They just like jiggle around. They're like different. Like they're not. Oh, you can't just always say the trigger starts right here. Like sometimes you'll like trigger that cutscene before you even get it. Like you can get onto the rooftop. It's weird. be quicker just to destroy that man. to voice act. Let's get the cutscene skip. Oh wait, it doesn't exist. What are you, what are you doing down there? I swear oh, my PB my like beats Panda King at no one hour. But hey, Murray, that doesn't seem right. So I hurry oh, over I'm not doing that bad. I've had a couple dumb deaths, but like all the things I had weren't like huge mistakes. I think the one in the freaking assault level in the swamp was kind of bad, but that's it. Thanks for the advice, Sly, but trust me, I got this under Yeah, it's archived. I haven't highlighted. I don't remember how long clockwork takes to do. The whole world that is. Oh my goodness. 
this. They're doing the drunk driving, dude. In the bad way. I'm getting no nitro luck. that it's in a good pattern next level. So I'm actually way ahead. Wow, it's nice. And my last world was kind of bad, too. And I really wish I had freaking not lost my horseshoe, because I would still have it by this point. And it, having a horseshoe makes the freaking last world so much more comfortable. Especially the first level. So the last section of the first level on that thing is really dumb, and failing it and dying makes you redo the whole auto scroller. Make, make it jelly. Jerry Kane of Notorious Cooper Thief Clan. Have you come here for? I'll revenge? be like to steal back the previous raccoonus. That was my half a minute ahead. But now I'm more interested in putting an end to your avalanche extortion racket. Why should you care if I bury yeah, a few worthless nice. village in snow? You are a thief, just like me. No, this part of this game is making right. mistakes. I am yeah. a thief from the a long heads. line of master thieves. While you, you're just a yeah, this is actually a decent artist run. turned homicidal pyromaniac. Surprisingly. You shall pay dearly for your disrespect. If I get a good last world, it'll be a new world record. Ancestry. I will send you to be cool, your my old one's kind of bad. Of my new firework technique. Flame, Flame fool. fool. is this? Oh, he almost hit me. I don't know why that took longer to hit there. I'm glad I waited there, because he did he like buffered another attack. So I did eight instead of okay, nine. Partner. Okay, not we were even on our way to the Krakara volcano in Russia. Like twenty seconds. While looking over what little information I had on the final member of the Fiendish Five, I began to notice something. In the four parts of the Thievius Raccoonus recovered so far, several of the pictures <laughs> depict a shadowy owl like figure, which looks very similar to the face of the Sly Cooper clockwork. clans thieving okay is that they steal from other thieves. Or is there something I'm missing? So it's like whatever. I hope this level doesn't go badly. This is a probably one of the worst levels that like, this is the worst level to fail at. And it's kind of dumb just because it's freaking annoying to hit these owls. It's this turd thing. It shoots like a billion bullets, but like, it doesn't hit anything. Yeah. 
kind of like Robin Hood, except he doesn't give to like the poor. Which I don't know if they, I don't think they ever say what they do with this stuff. But they steal. The last house section is all where the slow mo really matters. Hit the rocks! Okay. That game is the worst. Game. This whole world just sucks. Oh, I swear there's another owl there. Oh, I cannot hit these things, dude. I'm aiming right at it. Okay, here we go. Here's where the run either goes well or badly. Okay, nice. that was actually really good. Looks like we're in the clear. Hurry, that cave doesn't look tall enough for the turret to make it all the way through. Well, this isn't Russia, so maybe he's a Russian robot. They're right behind me. What is this? I'm flying. Uh, I thought I was doing pretty well. Like, I look over at their score and they're like right behind me. Oh my goodness, dude. That was horrible. Usually they're like freaking at like 42 when I finish. <laughs> I think it's time for some <laughs> like I must have just gone bad drops or something. That would have been awful if I failed that. Alright. This trick is kind of dumb. Oh, I freaking landed on the rail, right? But it just. They still got me. Land on it kind of low. Oh, okay. I don't know if there's rubber band AI. There might be. Okay. No, 
prefer. To just not fail this no mini game. This mini game sucks. You got me wrong, Miss Fox. After this, if I get the cutscene skip after this, then that'll be like a free minute for me because my <laughs> record didn't get it. So you have like a few frames to pause before the cutscene starts to so let you skip it. I knew this was a trap. Looks like I'm going to have to do some fast and furious hacking to shut down that gas. And then I can't lose much more time than my record did in the lava escape level. So I might gain some time there. Haven't had to do this in a while. Carnival, Lita. Oh, don't shoot at me. Uh oh, I'm an idiot. I hate these stars too. I can just shoot right at it, it's like it doesn't hit it. What the frick, dude? Just grab this and then get out of here. No, 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 no. No, okay. Cut it close like a few times now. <laughs> Fly, I was wrong about you. Break me out of this force field by smashing its face, and I'll make it up somehow. <laughs> <laughs> I, I really hope I get this cutscene skip. Just gonna have to hope my mashing is good enough. Likelihood of getting a world record is just increased by a lot now. It's like limiting my shots. Oh wait, there's this guy. <laughs> what am I doing? Okay, he's not stuck in the wall. It's like super limiting my shots right now. Oh, I frickin' missed him! Alright, this level's over. No, they're gonna get you! JK. Oh, I didn't get- YES! <laughs> nice job. I love when they knock one of the slugs off. <laughs> like the best part of the level. Alright. Time to do Annie strats and not die a bunch, hopefully. Give me your power, Annie! Oh my word. That was quick. Whoo, Annie! Annie blessing. Oh my. That just saved me, like, so much time. Don't even try jumping around this. Ooh! My heart just skipped a beat there. Oh my word, why does this game do this to me? That frickin' first spire was right in front of me, and it's like, I'm gonna go for the one that's on the other side. That's like, just behind this frickin' lightning that will kill you. <laughs> oh my word. I just happened to get really lucky there with it not killing me. Oh 
Oh my. Oh. My heart, dude. That just frickin' <laughs> scared me so bad. I'm assuming Sly doesn't like miss one of the rails with his intended game mechanic. Or that, like, his head doesn't flip around and knock me to the lava. This should be a world record. Oh, it's his feet. Why do I keep thinking it's his tail? Now it's his tail. My intellect. So much, why did you let me live when you stole the devious raccoons? Because I must have been so world without your precious pig. The Cooper line was Even if I was submitting, I wouldn't have forced. I wouldn't have submitted this wrong, doesn't though. Create great thieves. It takes great thieves to I shouldn't say that before I finish the wrong. I'm pretty sure I'll get a PB, but anything could happen in that last section. Going up to clockwork. I've definitely died. Because he frickin' misses, like, a rail or whatever. You cannot escape me. This used to be really scary for me, but now it's like the easiest part of this whole level. I like the sound piece of Okay, that was quick. You can't dodge me forever. Cool. Alright, here we go. Feeling lucky. I am. Tricky maneuvering, but I managed to snatch that last piece of the Thievius Raccoonus from Clockwork's claw. Cool. I had taken down each member of the Fiendish Five: Raleigh, Mugshot, Ms. Ruby, the Panda King, and finally Clockwork. I'd beaten them all one by one and reclaimed my birthright. It's like a PB for like two minutes. Of course, there was no <laughs> way I could have gotten here without the help of my pals. I know this hasn't been easy for them, yeah. but they stuck with me through it all. Oh, uh, it's below my strength. I think it's Murray. 120, Boy, 40. It took a lot of guts for him to get out in the field with I me. I think. I know he was scared, but he's got more heart than anyone I've ever known. And thank goodness for yeah, Bentley. Yeah, 120, 40. Without so his I expertise, like I'd have never found my way off that rooftop in Paris. A guy couldn't ask for a better gang of friends. Thanks. <laughs> Who could ever forget uh, I think the lovely kind of run of this would want to be like Looks like we're not going to be friends anymore. I'm thinking. Now that Clockwork's death ray is out of commission, we're back to playing cops and robbers. I thought for sure she was gonna slap the handcuffs on me right then and there. I don't know. I don't know how many instead, mistakes I made. She was true to her word and gave me that ten second head start. Ten, nine, eight, seven, <gasps> six, five, four, three, two. Dude, don't diss Murray. One.
I felt bad leaving her stranded on that giant rock, but I knew it wouldn't be long before we'd see each other again. I like luck-based things, like, treated me really well, though. Like, both the catapults were pretty fast. And, uh... Let's see, Grave Undertaking went well. The friggin' Lava Escape went really well. <laughs> That's usually not that great for me. Just because the hook grab is kind of random. That costs a lot of time. <laughs> Slide is such a troll. Anyways. Alright, good night, Fino. Sweet dreams. Hot dog, man. Anyways. Two new PBs in one night. One of them is a world record. So I'm I think I'm just gonna end it on this good note. Oh, I feel like playing anything else right now anyways. Did you already do your crash too, Rabbit, or did you wanna start that now? Panbungo the Alright, I'll send people your way. I wouldn't go watch Rabid, aka Solar Bowler, aka many names. He's gonna do you doing Crash too many percent. It's a really entertaining game to watch a speed run off, and he's really good. Not I. Not I, Chozo. Anyways, thanks for watching everyone. See you later. Have a good night.